Welcome back to the beginner cookup series. Today I'm going to be walking you through the mobile app. This is literally on a cell phone, um, but this is very similar on a tablet. All right. So you use essentially use the desktop on a laptop or a actual desktop computer, or you use the mobile app in a tablet or um, actual mobile phone. Okay. So um, I'm going to be showing you literally on a mobile phone today as it is the most common. So here we are. All right, so inside here, this is how uh, this this home, I should say, like the mobile app in the home space is definitely getting revamped. Um, and so you might see things looking a little different. And if it is, absolutely let me know in the comments and I can go ahead and show you the new one. Um, so today we have, this is what I've recently clicked on. Um, we have our favorites in here. We have our spaces. These are all the spaces that are inside of here. If you click into them, it now shows us um, even more. Of course, then we have our documents. We have any dashboards, which there are no dashboards in here. It's also a free account, so free accounts don't have dashboards. Then we have the my work. This is anything that is assigned to me um, based off of a day. Okay. And then we have a calendar view here. There's nothing in here, so you can't really see it as much. But then we can also reorder the tabs. Okay. So let's say, for example, I want to have the my work all the way down here. Okay, because it makes more sense for it to open on my the my work. And then maybe it's the I want to have favorites. That makes more sense. Let's see. Maybe it's then the calendar. Actually, we won't want the calendar. Let's see. Maybe spaces and then the calendar. Okay, so now it's going to be even easier. So now it has redid my whole thing. I want it to be on the my work because that makes sense. All right now it's going to tell me everything and I'm going to be able to click into things. And now I'm going to be able to see everything that it has to do with this specific um, like thing, right? So easily navigating things. You can also use these three dots over here. Takes me to home, which is where we were, right? Takes me to the inbox, which is going to show you any of the things that are in the important other snoozed include. Okay. Well, it looks like we got one snoozed in there. All right. Then we, you can easily see what you have as favorites right here. All the spaces. If you toggle them open even more, you can see everything. All right. Then you have dashboards. There are no dashboards in here as this is a free account. Then you have all your documents and you can see how they are. I want to open all of them. So there are all the documents that we have in here. All right. So this is easily how we navigate the mobile app. So you can also go over here in the right hand corner and see any of your settings. But you need to see, do you want sound effects? Do you need to invite people? Do you want, what do you want it to look like? Right? I always have my, my systems in dark mode. <laughs> but you can change it there as well. All right. So that is a quick walkthrough of the mobile. But I want to also, we almost forgot down here, didn't we? You can also, this is your home, of course. You can also quick create um, track time, notepad. Um, invite people a document reminder or task. So let's say task, put your name in, you can um, put it where it needs to go, you can automatically set the dates, um, assign it to whomever. You can come through here, status, there's also task type, which is more advanced to thing, um, priority. We've got um, custom fields, if there's any custom fields where you're putting it. We've got, you can also attach something. And then you can create it. Okay. So that's a quick thing to do here. Next out of that, you can access your inbox from down here and the My Work as well. So that is how we do the mobile app. So if you have any questions on the mobile app, maybe yours doesn't look the same as what I just showed you. Um, it's totally possible as they're updating it. It even says it's experimental. If you look on my screen down there, um, it did say that at one point. So let me know if you have any questions. I'll be absolutely um, here to support you in getting your specific home, uh, I should say mobile device, to figure it out. And we can go ahead and go from there. But until then, let me know if you have any questions and uh, put those below and go ahead and check out the rest of the tutorial videos as they are super helpful, especially as a beginner.